Hey Photo Pips and welcome back to the channel. Just want to go over a few things with Photoshop CC. The way I feel the performance in the mechanics of the program is starting to really slow down the system. It's it's not good. I tend to feel that the brush strokes are just not married up with the way you use your stylus or the way you're controlling it with your mouse. Each brush stroke seems to just be lagging behind. So Looked into it, asked a couple of computer geeky friends to help me out and uh, they've come up with some answers. So if you follow the instructions I'm about to give you on the 2018 edition of Photoshop CC and also in Lightroom you should have no problems and the uh, program should start to feel back where it was six months a year ago. It certainly works for me so I hope it works for you guys too. Let's get on. First things first guys, open up Photoshop. Once Photoshop's open, go to the top left hand side of the panel, click Preferences, you need to find Performance. Now this is also the same on Windows, it's a slightly different layout, but the basic, the same. Open up Performance Menus, and this is the first section we're gonna look at, the memory usage. Now it's normally set at 70 megabytes, but you know, whack that up to around 75, 76, and that's going to help the system a lot. This panel is also very important. The uh, default setting for the history status is 50. Now, if you've got to go back 50 times, something is seriously wrong with whatever you're doing. So for me, 10, 11, 12, 15, even 20, you know, bring that down, that's going to help and uh, your, your cache level, stick that around four, uh, you're gonna have no issues with that. Now this is the, for me, was the main, main thing that really made such a difference, and that was this usage graphics processor. Now I, I deselected that, and once that was deselected, I felt that things were a lot better. Now I did these individually to find out how and what the performance levels were and for me that made all the difference so once you've done that click OK then you'll need to close down Photoshop and also quit Photoshop before they will take effect and that's it that's all there's to it so I hope this works for you um, I could not see that Lightroom was um, as in-depth as Photoshop but just by uh, turning that graphic processor off it was enough for me to actually do that and it works true and that's it okay guys don't forget have a great week and get out and shoot you know you want to cheers see you soon